You want to take your tech out with you, but you need to protect it. So today, I've got three cases for you. One for the Nintendo Switch, one for your iPad, and one for your laptop. All three will serve you very well. All three are brilliant, and all three are made by TomTok. Welcome, and as we said in the introduction, I've got three cases for you today. We're going to do the Switch, an iPad case, and a laptop case. And to start off, we're going to go straight into it. We're going to go in with the Nintendo Switch case. Now, I've already looked at a TomTok Switch case for the Switch Lite, and I'll leave a link up there where you can go and have a look at that. And I was super impressed with it. It's really good quality, and I think that's going to be a recurring theme for this video, is quality. All three cases are brilliant quality. So I just wanted to show you, go through with you with them. So I picked this one up off Amazon. I've been using it for a few days now. This will set you back around £20 or $20. And it is for the, the OG Switch. So going over it, it's the nice light grey yellow logo. And on the top, we have a decent wrist strap, completely removable if you want that on or off, it's up to you. Um, and then on the top, as you can see, it's slightly embossed. So as you can see there, that's for the D-pad and the thumbstick. And then the other side, the thumbstick and the buttons there. And on the bottom, it's raised up for the kind of triggers and the Joy-Cons. That is to help it get a little bit slimmer. Because if it wasn't like that, it would be have to be this thick. Whereas, kind of, it makes it as thin as possible and as light as possible. And going around, there's two really nice, good quality zips with a logo on. I'm a bit of a sucker for sticking logos everywhere. So that's really nice that they've, that they've included that. But the real treat is when you open it. So when you open it, you're greeted with just the best material for a case that you can get. It's just lovely. TomTok do not scrimp on their, their materials. And I'll explain that why in a couple of the other bits we've got. Just beautiful, beautiful quality. Love it. So that's really nice and that bit sits on the screen. When you fold it over, you've got a space for 10 games. And then again, this is really nice quality up here and really nice down there. So decent level of protection. It's kind of like quite a bit thick bit of cardboard in there. Similarly with the top as well, there's gonna be a bit, big thick bit of cardboard in there. And then you've got this, which is kind of this material and then a cardboard bit in there. So decent level of protection as well. So let's get the switch and let's stick it in. As you'd expect, it fits perfectly. And then, as we said, that folds over and that will rest on your screen, protecting the screen of your switch. Lovely. And then doing it up nice and thin profile. Really good quality. So this is kind of like this kind of material and it is waterproof as well. I wouldn't suggest dunking it in water, but water, if you sp sp spill some water on it, it will just slide off decent protection as well let's try and press the thumbsticks down yeah I really kind of yeah okay I can press the thumbstick down but I really have to press hard on these two so decent decent level of protection all round really good quality like I was saying these are these really really good quality you're not gonna be able to fit anything else in it it's literally just gonna be the switch and your 10 games you might be able to fit a cable in there, um, but you're not going to be able to fit much in there. So this is just a case, just for your Switch. Not much else more. But if you want something that's going to last and certainly protect your Switch, this is the one. Love it. And it's thin enough to go into other cases as well because it's a nice thin profile, which leads me nicely. I'm going to go back to uh, the, the laptop bag, put that in. Okay, so that, really nice, off, off Amazon, around £20, $20. I'll leave a link below where you can get hold of it. Uh, I'll leave a link down in, on Amazon where you can get hold of this one. Okay, so let's crack on. Let's get on to the next one. This is, yeah, this is the portfolio case. Okay, so it's for iPads, around the smaller iPad Pros and the smaller, the iPad Airs as well, and the 10.8, 10.2, sorry, iPad Air 8, and 
can also fit a smart keyboard as well if you've got that on. They do do a larger version for, because I've, I've got the larger iPad Pro, they do do a larger version for this. This is the smaller version. It's exactly the same, it's just a bit bigger. So again, it's got that material that's waterproof on there and it's got the gray which matches that perfectly and it feels really nice. Again, decent level of quality and protection, really nice. And on the top, it's got a handle, which is good quality, give that a yank, yeah, good quality. And again, the zips with a bit of branding on it, love it. Okay, and then when you open it up, as with this, lovely quality inside beautiful beautiful quality and then i have my ipad there in there as you can see decent amount of room and it can fit the smaller of the ipad pro in there no problem at all and this again is the quality here look at this it's just lovely really nice so that goes over onto the iPad screen, if you didn't have it in there, you have it on there, that would just rest on the screen just beautifully. Really like that, really like that quality. I prefer to have that in there. This is an and it's, it slips around a little bit, but it's not too bad, it's, it's, it's not an issue for me. And then over here, we have a place for an Apple Pencil or any sort of pens. You can have any bits in there, any other bits in there, and then three places in there for anything you need, cables, anything you carry away with you, any documents you want to put in there, and then another kind of like long pocket in there. So this is really for someone who's um, got the smaller of the iPad Pros or one of the iPad Airs, and you want to carry it, want to carry it around with you with a few extra bits, with it being quite a slim profile. That's a really nice slim profile with a decent level of protection. That's great. You're not going to be able to put a plug in there at all. You're just going to be able to fit um, kind of like just some cables in there as well. And anything else that you need to, to carry away with you. So this is really good. And as I've said before, with the, the switch case, just the level of quality is just lovely. It's just lovely. If you just want something that's decent quality, this is fantastic. Really nice. Okay, so that's the iPad case, that's the iPad portfolio. This is gonna be a set you around, around 30 pounds or around $30 as well, which is the bargain. Or the um, the more expensive, the larger one, it's a little bit more expensive, but they do do a larger version for the um, larger iPad Pro. And speaking of the larger iPad Pro, this is my one for, for, for the, um, this is my iPad Pro with the um, smart keyboard on it. And I put that in this bad boy. So this, is the TomTok shoulder bag. Okay, this will set you around 46 pounds, around $44. Links below where you can get hold of it. Um, this is brilliant. This is what I use to take all my stuff away with me because I have a laptop um, and I put that in there, but it also carries my iPad. So this is the iPad is what I use more of. So this will carry things like MacBook, your Dell XPS, things like that. And they go in the back there and I'll show you that in a bit because that's a bit of a treat. But I want to go uh, over it first. So it's the same material, it's not hard, okay, so it is kind of flexible, but there's loads of sponge in it, loads of sponge. And the TomTok logo, and a couple of zips, and a really nice stiff handle. So if you're gonna be carrying it like that, or on the sides, you've got yourself a shoulder, shoulder strap. Now this is, super comfy. I carry this around with me all day on last week and it's just super, super comfortable over the shoulder. Love it. And then when you open it up, as you'd expect, the first flap, you've got room for any bits and bobs in there. So you've got a mesh that goes all the way around. You've got a place, I've just got a spare battery in there. Another mesh pocket there and another large pocket there. So let's put this. So this is my switch light. This fits in here that way easily or the way I did it was I just carried my switch light in there and if you wanted to as well grab your switch I like that so if you're like me and have a switch and a switch light needed for the channel then you've got it for this or this on its own some extra bits in there really good okay that's not the best bit this is superb the best bit is on the back. 
So this is where you would put your laptop or anything else. And then when I open it up, look at this. Just, it's again, this quality is just lovely. Beautiful, beautiful feeling, soft. That's lovely. So when you put your, so this is my, my iPad Pro, when you put that in there, see how much room there is in there extra for things like larger laptops or MacBook Pros and things like that. Kind of like MacBook Pro would go up to the edge. That's where my iPad lives, in there, because it's so beautifully pressed between this lovely, lovely material. And then when that goes in there, then you've got room to stick anything you want in here, really. There's loads of room for it. There's two switches and my iPad, and that's it. You can put this in if you want to. So if you've got your, your iPad Air in one of these, you can do as well. So that will fit in there beautifully. However, you're not gonna be able to get much else in there. You won't be able to get any of these two in here. You can, I mean, you can stick that in there if you want, but it really does bulge out. Okay, I would suggest just that one, because then there's no bulge. And then zipping it up, it's a lovely, lovely package. I've got no worries, so my iPad's kind of there. No worries about that whatsoever, because there's loads of protection in the back there. Really, really nice. And it's all the usual things, anything you want to be putting in there. Place here. Pencil out there, pencil in there, books, pens, passport, documents, in-flight bag, yeah, love it, superb, this is really, really nice. Okay, so there we go, there's a brief look going over this case, this one, as I said, will set you back uh, £46 or $44, I think it's... If, you, if you're serious about protecting your stuff and you want to carry it away with you, something stylish, again, it's this grey material that's got a bit of splash proof for it, so there's no, po there's no problem taking it in the rain. I love it. I think this is really, really good quality. And then this, if you're looking for just an iPad case that's really nice, slim profile, probably to go with this, I would say, because they fit so well. Excellent piece of kit. And then first up, we looked at the switch. Nice thin profile. Can't carry much else other than just the switch, but for terms of quality and protection, I love it. Okay, so there's my look. Here's my look at the switch case, the iPad case, and, and the laptop shoulder bag. All from TomTop. All brilliant quality. Go and have a look in, down, the, um, down the links below where you can get hold of this. Let me know what you think. Have you got anything on TomTop? Um, what do you think of their stuff? I think they're really good quality, hence why I got all of these bits to use. Let me know down in the comments below. Okay, that's it then. Any questions, do let me know. Please do stick a thumbs up. Please do subscribe. It would help out the channel massively. And until the next video, bye-bye.